So Billy, I don't know if you saw that video of the teacher that has all these really cool handshakes with all of the students. I'm, I'm wondering, what teacher inspired you when you were growing up? Well, yeah, that, that was uh, Mrs. Hancock. Oh, really? Why? Oh. Why? Uh, well, I, I'm not really sure that I can say that on TV. <laughs> oh, oh well, we're not on TV. We're, we're on web TV. Oh, in that case, I mean, uh, it was probably because of her uh, very low... Oh, oh. <laughs> Okay, so Billy, what's the one thing that education should have prepared you for in life, but didn't? I'm really good at putting condoms on bananas, but I don't know anything about taxes. <laughs> what do you think? Taxes. Taxes. <laughs> I, I agree I, with you. I don't think I did my taxes this year. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to have a branch off on the taxes thing. Like, yeah. I know how to figure out the standard deviation of a population. Oh. Still don't know how to fill out a TDI form. <laughs> I, <know laughs> I thought I know how to find the right side of a triangle. But. Right? <laughs> it would have been useful, hey? <laughs> I completely agree. Financial planning, for sure. I mean, I know <laughs> a million people know how to, like, rock out hot crust buns on a recorder. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what an RSP is. <laughs> so is this guy Teacher of the Year? I mean... Who wouldn't love to have a, a head, head into class every day started like that with the cool handshakes? Hey, Billy? Yeah, I agree. Kids are gross. <laughs> <laughs> it depends, I guess. How cool is the teacher? How old is he? Mm -hmm. The demeanor of it? Yeah, that's true. Uh, I think a good teacher, a likable teacher, yeah, but teacher of the year, not even close. No. I mean, I know my dad used to ask me every day after school, like what we learned in school. And in this guy's case, I would say, well, we spent the last two weeks learning <laughs> <a> mistake <laughs> with this true. guy so he can get a bunch of hits on YouTube. I'm just impressed that you can remember all these handshakes. And stuff. I know. But what if, you, was... what if you're going into class and you forget your handshake? Are you not allowed into class? Or oh, like... yeah. And then you're not, you go to detention or something like that? Yeah, I don't What's know. What's the penalty? Don't in, hmm. no. no, you don't let them in. <laughs> So what makes a great teacher in your point of view, Billy? Uh, if, I guess if they don't mess up the kids too much and turn them into serial killers, they're okay. <laughs> All right, that's a good jumping off point. I'm thinking any teacher that can get through their career without beating the crap out of a student <laughs> or a parent, All they're right. doing all right. Uh, as long as I don't lose my marbles. There was a teacher in high school at the beginning of the last year. He handed around a fish bowl full of marbles. He said, take as many as you want. You're going to need them. By the end of the year, you lose all of them. But, you know, it's, it's good to have a few spares lying around. <laughs> <laughs> Probably passing grades. If you pass me, I'll be happy. I had one teacher that wrote my midterm for me. It was great. Oh, oh wow. Yeah. Holy so I wouldn't fail the class. That's it was awesome. of being an oh, yeah. attractive woman. <laughs> <laughs> My teacher was a female, so how does that work? Well, I mean... It's 2017. <laughs> well, let's shift things a bit, okay? Um, there's another story coming out of New Orleans about a student who had coitus with not one, but two of his English teachers at the same time. The parents of the students are now suing for trauma that occurred from the nine-hour ordeal. Billy, did you hear about this? Uh, one man's trauma is another man's fantasy. <laughs> I heard about it. I, I, whenever I hear about these stories, I just there's a comedian that has one of my favorite jokes where he said, what are these parents suing for? These teachers giving this kid unshakable confidence for the rest of his life? <laughs> Do you think he's right? Unshakable confidence? I mean, if you can go for nine hours? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah, nine hours. I'm not sure if it would be absolutely horrified or really impressed by that. His gym teacher is going to be really impressed. The stamina of that kid. <laughs> Was it like a rally? <laughs> All right, our hot button question, people. Now, if you were a teacher, what class would you teach and why? Billy? Mixology. Because if I taught sex ed, I'd have to go to court. Uh, <laughs> Adulting 101. Oh, adulting 101. I'm an, I'm an actor. Like, what am I going to teach, really? Math, definitely. I'll teach math. Okay. <laughs> Phys ed, easy. They don't have to do anything, and you can just work kids at dodgeball <laughs> that you don't like. <laughs> so, Billy, I heard something that you were at the top of your class in school. Is that right? Yeah, it's true, but, you know, homeschooling isn't that easy. <laughs> oh. Well, that's all the time we have for today. Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to like our videos, share, and subscribe. Bye-bye.